All right, I'm in Goodwill. Did my preliminary. I got a couple things in my card, as you can see. Um, this is pretty. It's 509, but I have no use for it. That style does not go well for me. Very pretty, though. Very pretty. And here's a cute Christmas tree. It's LED, and it's made to look like a snowman. I don't see a price on it, though. But he's flocked, and then you put the snowman hut on the top. It's really cute. It's a cute piece. I just wanted to show you something really quick before it goes. They have it priced at $7.09, so I'm not getting it. And it's a very big elephant, but he is really cute. He's really, really cute. And um, these are kind of neat. Kind of have that Pier 1 look or Ikea. That's a cool set. And uh, I like the wood burning on this cheese dish. Very pretty floral. All right, I'll be back. All right, we're here in the miscellaneous slash holiday aisle. Oh, Nightmare Before Christmas. That's their new stuff, okay. That's their new stuff that they have. Oh, aren't these guys cute? Aw. I thought they were bells, but they're not. But we have, what is it, a snowman? Oh, his nose is broken off. All right, well, that's okay. No big deal. No big deal. A little Santa crafts. We have some uh, barbecue sauce here. Temptations, but it's not in here. It's empty. A uh, big bag of gourds. And an old Santa candle that doesn't smell like anything. He's 209. Another mask there. A uh, big bag of fake fruit down there for 1509. We're not going to worry about that. Uh, and we have more vegetables. Plates. Oh, here's a good here's a good snowman one. Oh, he's cute. I don't know if anybody's gonna want them. I guess you can make them into ornaments. Ah, I don't need them. I don't need them. I have to be quick today because I have an appointment. What is this outlet thing? Is that a costume? That's very strange. There's a lot of strange stuff in here all the time. Um, let's see what else we have. We have some more Easter. We have some leftover Halloween, some St. Patrick's Day. We have this guy, the plush uh, Christmas tree. I pressed his foot. He he has plays music for about two seconds, and then he stops, and he doesn't move anymore. So I remember these little flocked boots. That's cute. You probably hang from the tree and put little treats in there. That's adorable. I think they still make these now. So we're going to leave him. There's no price on them. It's pretty velvet roses. Single roses here for $1.09 each. Very pretty. Um, let's see what else we have over here. Porcelain hurricane lamp. What is this? Oh boy. That's empty too. Welcome to Hope Valley. Okay. Uh, it's not in here, so don't have to worry about that. And let's see what else. We have some wrapping paper. Not old, old wrapping paper. I know some of you like that to craft with, but I don't see any of that here. Mm, some poinsettias. That box of uh, ornaments is still here. And let's see what else we have. Elf is still here. Here's a cute bunny clown. And some Easter figurines up here. We have a glass tree and some bags and another bag of Christmas stuff, which is probably expensive. I don't even know what's in it. It doesn't look good anyway. All right, so we're going to not worry about that either. Here's another one of those kitschy Christmas. You put them around your candles. Um, this one looks to be in decent shape. Let's see how much is it? One on nine. They look like little cookies. That's cute. I think I'll get that. All right, so that's it for the miscellaneous aisle. It is packed, though. There's quite a bit of stuff here. That's pretty. That garland. That's nice. The blue roses. All right, moving on. All right, we might as well check out the metal aisle. It's a beautiful big lantern with a pillar, big pillar candle in there. That's nine oh nine. Uh, tissue box. Oh, this is a neat shape. 
that's what this that's what this aisle is like folks <laughs> it's booby trapped it's booby trapped sorry hope i didn't make anybody dizzy um oh those are cool put your candles on them all right see if i go to move that that's going to slide off so we're not going to really touch anything here i'll just show you stuff uh what is this is that an old recipe box back there let me see no what is that no trespass oh it's a little haunted house tin oh from hot topic that's cute grab that i didn't see that before i grabbed my stuff earlier just to get some stuff then i'll go over the condition later um the chopsticks are still here ah oh, it's a mess here though there's stuff all over the floor try to get by um this was cute here but it's missing paint harvest of friends they chip very easily unfortunately all right let's see what we have wire baskets and that's a some kind of tree that you would hang stuff on like a family tree there's a metal cross pretty t uh verdigree they did the faux verdigree on it and let's see what else we have here i don't know if denise is going to show up i have an appointment today so i can't stay as long as i usually do a cute little yellow pitcher decor use only okay no point in having that i like this big bowl all geometric shapes in it that's kind of neat there's a watering can welcome for your garden and oh this is adorable the punch tin little house i remember when that stuff was popular look at this tray with the birds 409 okay that can stay and i'm still trying to get to go to different places different goodwill but they're not as good as this one they don't oh, that's moving okay we'll just keep that there very dangerous here <laughs> It's very very dangerous so I can't just pull a lot of things off the shelf to show you all right um I think that's it here for the metal yep okay this is the uh, cups and glasses hold on one second sorry I had to go see they had another cart they were bringing out but these are the cups and the dishes I mean the cups and the glasses and sometimes I find some pretty good novelty mugs I'm having a mug sale coming up this week but when you see this it will be have already happened last week so uh if you haven't already done so please subscribe to my channel hit that like set that notification bell to all for my channel i do have memberships for my channel as well if anybody wants to join because i do sell this stuff on my channel so if you're interested in anything please send me an email or come to the sales it's a lot of fun a lot of times i have guests on with me as well that are also thrifters and also pinned to the top comment under the video will be a link. If you click on that link, it takes you to all my Thrift With Me videos. And you can see some of my awesome, awesome finds from uh, months ago. Some really cool stuff. I took a picture of this earlier. It's this old screwdriver glass, but it's faded from the dishwasher. Stop putting these things in the dishwasher, people. And I'm not seeing much here. Um, here's an old Spice of Life chopper. That's about it. I don't like the new trolls. I like old trolls. And I don't see anything here to pull out to show you. So I think we're going to go to another aisle. They're bringing out a lot of carts of stuff. But I have to watch the time because I have to go somewhere. So um, yeah, that's it. I looked at these already. I didn't see anything interesting that stood out to me no funny sayings or special pictures or anything so um that is it for the cups and glasses and mugs aisle all right and i found a lonely tarot card so i don't know what happened with the rest of it but there's one tarot card on the shelf wish i could find the whole thing probably not in one piece though We have a good amount of lamps today, but nothing special. 
Uh, never really found a good lamp here that I wanted that was affordable. I right, just wanted to show you. So I saw I saw this. This is cute. It's a large ornament. It's not glass. It's acrylic. But it's a Santa. It's a quite large Santa ornament. And they want $309 for it. But I don't need that either. So we're just going to leave that on the shelf. you cute though. And I just picked up this awesome vintage Santa cookie jar. Isn't he glorious? $309. All right, let's go down the wood aisle. There's a lot of stuff here. Um, oh, I remember these. That's cute. The tile, ceramic tile for 209. Glitter lava jar. Don't know what that's for. Another cigar box. Hemingway. That's nice. 409 for that. Uh, what else do we have? We have some broken stuff. Candle holders. I did grab a couple things from this aisle already. Oh, that's a pretty box with the um, fake flowers in it. 409. That's very uh, cottage core looking. That is really pretty. I'm not going to sell it in my booth though because it would take too long for us to sell because I don't really normally sell that style. But it's worth it. There's a ship. Nice ship. And the barometer is still here, as you can see, under there. And let's see what else we've got. Got a nice song. Oh, look at the air blown. Let's check him out and see if he works. Air blown ghost. Put him in the cart. Now, I found this and I'm like, ooh, is it glassy, baby? It's not. It's not. It is a Mikasa one. They made to look like the glassy baby. So... There you have it, folks. There's another sign. Uh, this is a Treasure Island book box. It's a faux book. And that is 409. And a cute little girl. Those were popular in the 90s. There's some trays. Some kind of trays, plain trays. They look vintage, they feel vintage. My humans are getting married. Oh, that's cute. That's very cute. We have some cedar shoe stretchers. This is Love and Kisses Scented Soft Silk Rose in a box. And that's $4.99. And let's see what else we have up here. I don't see anything special up there. I guess we are done here in the wood. That's a neat thing to put on the wall, and it's got clips on it. Very farmhousey. Okay, I don't see anything else that stands out to me to show you guys here. A lot of stuff, but you know, quantity doesn't mean quality. So, but that's about it. Um, let me turn it this way really slow. And these are the baskets, and I already checked out the baskets to see if there were any interesting ones, and I didn't really see any. That hit me so we're not gonna go over this but you get an overview of them what they look like okay I'm here in the plush aisle um, craniums don't sell well for me either they do for other people but I'm leaving the cranium game a uh, turbo edition behind but I'm trying to see if there's anything to show you here oh there's a Bucky's beaver hand puppet he might be something. I don't know. I'm not really into all that. But I'll think about it. I'll put him in the cart. Uh, a couple large stuffed animals on top, like this giant triceratops dinosaur. And we have a minion, a couple bears, some things that have been here since last time. This is a little, I don't know, what is that? A shake? Cappuccino? I uh, don't see a tag on it. I don't see a maker tag on it, so i um, trying to get around, but I can't, so I'm going to be stuck here for a minute. Baby with a reindeer costume on. This is a nice bear. Let me see who makes him. I uh, don't know. It looks like an older one. Uh, thing for your hamster. And there's other ones that I can't get to right now. So if there's anything good, I will let you guys know. 
Okay, we're here in the mishmash while we got a chance. Um, these were pretty angel porcelain ornaments. I don't know if you could see them or not. Uh, and they have real feather wings, but one of them's broken. So they're going to stay here. We have some of this Bernat red. Uh, looks like the eyelash type. But I don't know. I'm not going to pick up anything like that. That really doesn't go good for me either. There's quite a bit of it here. We have our diapers. And we have a, a Rawlings. What is that? Highlight? How much is it on there? 409. We'll have to look that one up and see. We got our first Brenda Har right there. And well, this thing's full of stuff. Antler headband and napkins and things. Oh my. We have our notebooks up here, our binders as usual. And more leftover Halloween stuff, vampire teeth. We got some dice for your car. What is this? I could color a uh, birdhouse. Some more Brenda Har. Boxing gloves. Whoa, here's a whole bunch of Brenda Har. Oh, look at the wine and beverage charms. They're little flowers. 109. I'll get them. I could convert them into jewelry. Very cool. All right, and we got all this. Oh, this goes from black to auburn to red. That one's neat. And we got black, pre rinsed, pre stretched. Then we have uh, black to blonde. We have auburn, we have white and blue and purple, and there's just tons of hair here. Tons and tons of hair here. What's your favorite color, Brenda? Just asking, what's your favorite color? He 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 he. Uh, and that's just a little craft project stuff. I don't know what these are. Single, oh, they're lanyards. Say single malt scotch on them. I'm losing stuff, stuff's falling off my cart here. I gotta move over. Okay. Perfect bacon bowl. Some CD cases. No, this thing just doesn't want to stay. I'm gonna put it there. Okay. Um, more Brenda Har. More Brenda Har. Ooh, that's a pretty like cobalt blue color. Oh, there's a lot to choose from. A lot to choose from. And feathers and more crafting stuff in there. Scrapbook album. And I think we're done. We're done over here. More Brenda Har, more Brenda Har. And uh, what is that? Uh, it's just a picture. Okay. Done here in the mishmash. It is a fill, but like I said, we're looking for uh, quality over quantity. So that's it over here. All right, I'm just gonna show you in general the purses here. I did grab a coach one, a green one. I'm gonna take a look at it. They do 115 for it. So I have to be careful. I wanna go check it out and do some research on it. There's a Vera. I have plenty of Vera right now I have to sell. I'm gonna have a purse sale coming up soon too. I wonder if this matches the, is this two? Um, I don't think so. I thought this, they had a, like a different model of a smaller version with the same color. Uh, some Lily Blooms and there was a pretty, oh here, a pretty Betsy Johnson, but it's, it's all tore up. But that is it for the purses. Nothing very exciting. And here's another coach purse. They want $20.99 for it. So uh, that's going to stay here. Somebody will get a good deal on it though today for senior day so I'll just leave that showing out so somebody could grab it I just saw this on the end it's acrylic though but look it's stitch it's a stitch glass that's very cute I don't know I might get him too love stitch I'll show you some stuff in the knickknack aisle I already picked stuff from here too trays glasses there's a clock and a teapot that's interesting um votive holders there's a carrot i don't know what that would be for here's a clown so 
think we'll see more clowns. Probably some of these clown collections got donated. Handcrafted made in France. Oh, cool. Four nine for that. That scared me. Little things here and there. There's a thing for like a mortar and pestle. It's like granite. It's so heavy. Basket. I don't know if I could get down the aisle, guys. So I might have to uh, wait a bit here. Those are nice jars. Green jars. Enter those. Um, oh, 509. Okay, those can stay. Those would be nice for Christmas to put stuff in. And some boxes. Santa, here's some um, Dalmatians. The mercury glass is now broken. See the crack in it? That was from last week. Here's another mortar and pestle without the pestle. And that's cute. A little gingerbread house. I think it's for burning candles under it. Uh, a Perot or a clown. We're not going to touch that. Not interested. These are still here. Nobody grabbed them yet. Elephant's still here. This is cute. Uh, has that Le Creuset feel to it. I'm trying to get my cart to go straight here. That's a cute little scene. There's a teapot that looks like a beehive. That's cute. And some container. Here's a town hall for a Christmas village. What is this? I don't know what that is. No clue. Not worried about it. Oh, there's some stuff back there. Hold on. Okay, false alarm. Nothing, nothing to show you back there. This is um, that for your curtains. There's only one though. It's cool that he's a lion. Got some stuff back here. Let's see. What is that? That's a cute little dish. Cute little dish. 309 for that. All right. There's somebody's project piece. And some candles. We got a cute snowman here. Let's see. Hallmark. He's in three sections. I don't know what he's for. We're going to get him. He's cute. He's got a cute little face. There's a faux wood grain box. It's very light though. But it's neat. It does look like wood. There's one of those old... Easter Easter egg trinket dishes. That's very cute. Homemade piece. And uh, I'll be back. Here is a beautiful dove. I don't know who it looks at. I don't know if it's broken. 309 for that. Let's put it up here so you can see it better. Look how pretty that is. That is gorgeous. Um... It's kind of, it's like bisque ware. It's very pretty. I don't know. I don't see anything under there. Maybe it's under the sticker. We'll see. All right, I will be back. These are interesting. They are marked Starbucks. They're very interesting. They don't have a handle. Very cool. Different. All right, let's try to get through here, this side. See what we've got. We left off here. Um, there's a couple people ahead of me, so I had to wait my turn. There's a cute little turkey dish for two oh nine. Um, let's see what else we have here. That poor piggy is still here. I feel so bad for it. <laughs> uh, there's a round piggy down there, and the angel's still here. We have a teddy bear. Some tall red candles. Um, oh, that's a cool vase. I like the shape of that. That's kind of neat. Oh, it's not. It's a tumbler. That's kind of cool. Here's a little metal trinket box. Heart. They want 309 for that. Okay, well, that can stay. Somebody else can get that. And that's the mug I put back last time. This would have been nice if it had its lid. And this is 209. What is this? Oh yeah, we have the little praying children too here. But they're all chipped up. 
cute. What is this with the little uh, 509 for that? And not really seeing anything else over on this side. We'll move over to the other side. Hold on. Okay, we're on the opposite side. A lot of clear glass things. Oh, there's a Baltimore mug. That's kind of pretty. And some vases, your typical stuff. That's a nice purple glass bowl or vase. Um, some kind of music box with bears on it. And let's see what's under here. 109 for that. Are you blue sky? You're something else. I'm going to check you out and see where you're from. And it's a wacky pumpkin. Oh, it's an M&M &M pumpkin. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what it does, but I don't need that. No interest. Okay, some more glasses, punch bowls. If you need vases, this will be the place to go. And I'm going to leave those Starbucks behind because they don't interest me. And hopefully somebody will get that bird before uh, somebody breaks it. And this is about it for this side. Not much to show. Not much to show once I get to this side. All right. I think the recap's coming soon. Here's a couple things they put out. Little angels. Little set of angels. He's great, Frosty, but his pipe is missing. It's broken off. But he is awesome. If he had his pipe, I would have grabbed him. Tried cleaning him up. He is a little dirty. He's got that snow kind of texture to him. I love him though. Go so cute. Right, I'm here in the dishes and the plates. Here is a Temptations for $5.09. I don't bother with that. Temptations anymore. I can't get rid of what I have. Uh, these are kind of cool. Chicken soup bowls. You got blue glass. I don't get any more of those. I do have some at home already. Uh, some of the old stoneware. Pretty transferware plates. There is, these are cool. These are cool to use from like shrimp scampi and stuff. Two twenty-four each. They're neat. Um, here's a bank. A treasure chest bank. Stopper is missing from it. Does have some crazing. Has some age. I don't know who makes it. Maybe it's underneath the sticker. I don't know. These are great. I use these at home all the time. Oh, let's see what we have here. A bunch of random dishes. Neat pattern there. Um, just trying to get through and show you guys this stuff. That's pretty. It looks like a sweater. It's got a chip on it, unfortunately. Otherwise, that would be a cute uh, butter dish to pick up. They do sell well for me. Uh, I did get some clear pirates. I'll show them to you in the recap. That's a pretty pattern. False graph. That's nice. There's some red dishes. It's white. Oh, no, it's pottery. I thought it was white glass. Those are cute. We have more stoneware. And let's see what else we have here. We have some saucers. And the. Oh, those are pretty. I don't know if you could see them through there. Those are neat. Um, these are old with the leaves on them. I remember them. What is this up here? That's cute. How much are you? Bella Casa, 209. Hmm, looks like it's missing something in the middle. It also has some crazing. Pretty mug. There's a picture that somebody did some decoupage on. Uh, a candy dish. Here's an old bowl. Uh, we seriously love you. Some dishes for corn. That's pretty. Thompson brand. It's a nice mug. I got a lot of floral mugs I need to sell, so I'm not worried about that. And that's about it for the for the dishes and plates. 
Here's a pretty uh, jug made in Italy. It's 309. Not my style, the things I like to get. This is cute too. This is like plated over brass. I think they're peacocks. 309 for that. We're going to leave that. And I think that's it. I think we're done. I think we're done. Well, this is a shame. This is a light up ceramic light up, like a light up Christmas tree. You would put the lights on the trees and um, you would light up the church. And it's only 509. It's got the stained glass, but the stained glass got all faded. Uh, the steeple's missing. Otherwise, I would have picked that up. Very nice, nice to see that though. Very cute. All right, place is packed. I gotta get out of here, I'm too hot. I'm going to show you some stuff. I might narrow it down afterwards, and I might not have gotten certain things. If you're interested, just let me know. Um, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit that like. Hit that notification bell. Set it to all. Also, please check out my other Thrift With Me videos. There's a Georgie, link. One of them is the light fixture up front. There's a link pinned in the top of the comments on all my Thrift With Me video videos, and check them out. Check them out. I also have memberships for the buyers. Um, I do sell stuff on my channel. So, um... Come check me out, guys. Let me know where you where you uh, where you joined from. All right, so we have this is for candles. Got that one. I'm thinking of the Bucky's puppet. The um, Hallmark snowman. The three pieces. I still don't know what he is yet, but we'll see. This is a glass golf cart ornament. This I have to check and see who makes it. It's pretty with the birds on it. Nice for Christmas. These flower wine charms, blown glass. I have to see if this guy works, maybe, or I'll just leave him behind, I'm not sure. He was open, so maybe somebody tested him already. I have to see what this is. I don't know if it's a pillowcase or what. Oh, twin. No, nope. tweet. What does this say? I can't read it. Um, maybe that. Here's a little haunted house tin um, from Hot Topic. Why is this not focusing? Focus on something. Come on. It doesn't want to. There it is. It focused. Um, another one of these candle rings with the cookies on them. We have this little birdhouse, birdhouse house, it's very cute. Um, this is for somebody that uh, I want to send to them. Uh, the coach purse, I still have to check it out further, it is a little dirty inside. Uh, a squirrel figurine, I want to make sure he's in okay condition. This is a little... Santa bag with little miniature vintage figurines in it. An owl mug. I have to check his condition. Um, this is a uh, olive wood. I think it may be a crutch. I'm not sure. Two shelf units, little ones. I have to check this out. This is a droid, a R2D2 kit. I'm gonna see if that's all complete. I have to check on this baseball glove here um this guy's awesome let me try to make room here uh the stitch cup the plastic stitch cup this guy's great the vintage um santa cookie jar he's awesome uh this glass peach or apple blown glass frosted glass let's see a Millefiori paperweight. Very pretty. I'm trying to talk over the music. I have to look this up. It looks like one of those French presses with the filter in it. So I don't know what that is yet. Um, these are Pyrex. They're clear Pyrex. There's four of them, two of each pattern. So um, these are $1.09 each for the smaller bowls. Sorry if I'm making anybody dizzy. And these, oh, these are $1.09 each as well. So those are beautiful. Beautiful Pyrex. Gorgeous Pyrex there. Really nice. Then we have a Yoga Goddess. 
We have a last rights kit. It is split in the top, but I'm going to get it anyway. I think it's a last rights kit. Maybe it's not. It's a clear, like, coffin style uh, jewelry box. Here's a pig figurine with a pacifier. Um, quite interesting. Uh, this is glass, art glass. Then we have, this is another shelf like the one that's underneath the cart with the log slices. Here's a piece of log, uh, like a Lazy Susan thing. The, the bark is coming off. I don't want to lose the bark. So I might get that. Then we have this figurine with the cats. Very cute. I don't know who makes it. Then we have these are wood carved candlestick holders. They look um, African, maybe from Kenya. And um, that's everything, guys. A lot of stuff, a lot of stuff. Um, again, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit that bell. Uh, hit that notification bell. Set it to all. Hit the like. Leave a comment below. And check out that link that shows all the other Thrift With Me videos. Some amazing finds, guys. you got to go back and watch some of those. But um, thank you for watching, guys. I do have to take off. So uh, until next time, see you on the flip side. Thank you for watching. Bye. Bye, guys. Thank you.